for joining today. Um, today's lesson, we're going to go over Shade, a really pretty song off of the uh, latest Sigma Oasis album. Um, a lot of bar chords in this one. Um, not too terribly difficult, uh, but we'll go over all those shapes and all that good stuff. As always, if you haven't already, please click the subscribe button and hit the bell for notifications. And let's hop in. Alright, so Shade starts out on this uh, little intro here, which is going to be a B flat to an F to an E flat. And so the way I was playing that there, um, <clears throat> so B flat barring the 6th fret here, and we've got our middle finger on the 7th fret of the G. Uh, ring finger is on the 8th of the uh, A, and pinky on the 8th of the D. There's your B flat there. So, a little strum there. So then on, um, on this G string here, you put your pinky finger on the 8th fret. And just do a little um, bit, pull off, hammer on. So, B flat. Your F, your F, uh, and then F again, just barring, barring the uh, eighth fret here and the tenth fret. So you got your F chord, and that there um, again on that G. So you have your your F chord shape here. You just hit that G. that 10th fret, so. Now, this is E flat here, where you're barring um, the 6th fret and the 8th fret, but you can also just play these three strings here on the 8th fret, and that's also an E flat. So that's how that's how you'll see Trey do that um, a lot of times. So go through that real slowly here. flat, which we've already gone over. We have a G minor, barring, barring the third fret. We've got our ring finger here on the fifth of the uh, A, and pinky on the fifth of the D. That's your G minor. And you've got a C minor. Uh, keep, keeping that bar on the third. Now you've got your middle finger on the fourth of the B, um, pinky finger on the fifth of the G, and ring on the fifth of the D. That's your C minor. Then you have an E flat. So you can play your E flat here, where you're barring the sixth and the eighth fret, or you can play it up here. So basically a, a D shape, but move down one fret. So you've got your index finger here is on the third fret of the G, a uh, middle on a third of the E, and ring on the fourth of the B. The one thing you want to make sure of though, if you're Playing it like this, you do not want to hit that D string. Because you get that, it does not sound good. So you want to make sure you're playing it like that, if you want to play it that way. Alright, so for the uh, verse here, it's a strumming pattern. This is a um, really slow song, 4-4 uh, four, four time, so we're just going to do four down strums um, for each chord here. Changes a little bit there, of course. So you've got your your uh, G minor. So it's one, two, three, F, E flat. One, two, three. So you do that twice, and then you go into the.
All right, so the only other piece of the song is the second portion of the chorus. Uh, and there's one new chord in there. It's got an A flat add nine. It's a really cool chord. Um, so basically, kind of taking this uh, little tray A shape here. Um, <clears throat> so index finger on the fourth fret of the uh, B, middle finger on the fifth of the G, and ring on the sixth of the D, and pinky on the sixth of the high E. So second time through the chorus, it starts the same way. So B flat to B flat. And then we're going to go with this B flat. Alright guys, thank you very much for joining. Please leave any feedback, comments below, and we'll see you again soon.